If you need to add the fractions 1 6 plus 4 thirds, here's how you do it. What we want to do is get a common denominator. Right now we have 6 and 4. But if these are the same, then we just add the numerators together, bring the denominator across, and we're done. So let's do this. 4 times 3, that would be 12. And 6 times 2, that would be 12. So we'd have 12 in our denominators here. We'd be in good shape. But we can't just multiply the denominator by a number. We need to multiply the numerator by the number as well. Let's just 3 over 3. That would just be 1. So when we multiply by 1, we don't change anything, just the way it's represented. Over here, 2 times 1. And now, 2 times 1 is 2. And 2 times 6 is 12. 2 twelfths, that's the same as 1 6. They're equivalent. Over here, 3 times 3 is 9. And 4 times 3 is 12. And 9 twelfths, that's the same as 3 fourths. They're equivalent fractions. But now we have the same denominator down here. We're just going to add the numerators. 2 plus 9, that equals 11. And then when we add fractions, we have the same denominator. We just bring that right across. We end up with 11 twelfths. So 1 sixth plus 3 fourths equals 11 twelfths. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.